Hello, and welcome to the Apex CC TV continuing video configuration tutorial for the S Vivitec ST7501. In this segment, we will be covering camera configuration. To begin this, you will need to open up an internet browser and connect to the camera. Once connected, you will need to log in with an administrative ID. Once logged into the camera, you will need to scroll down and click on the link for configuration. On some of the newer cameras, you will have a choice between a basic mode and an advanced mode. I recommend that you set this in an advanced mode. You can then name the camera whatever you would like to name it. I strongly recommend that you set the time zone correctly and whenever possible have it do it automatically via an NTP server. Here I'm using pool.ntp.org. Save those settings. The next section you need to go to is security. For these cameras to be connected to the ST7501, the root user must have a password. Set the privilege levels you would like to do for your users. You can also add any additional users down below. Save any changes you make. Under network is where you will specify whether you're running a static IP address or a dynamic IP address. In our location, we are using static IP addresses. This page is also where you will specify your HTTP port, which is the web port, as well as your RTSP ports. This is important to note in case you have to do any port forwarding or port adjustments. The next section we're going to go to is audio and video. This section is where you can adjust the video quality settings and the compression type for each one of the streams. Not all Vivitec cameras support multiple streams, but the ones that do usually support multiple codecs. With this configuration, you can specify one low resolution for viewing and a high resolution for recording. This is also where you can specify the audio settings. The next section we're going to look at for this camera is motion detection. Motion detection is required if you intend on doing recording based upon motion events in the ST7501 NVR software. So go to the motion detection section, enable the motion detection checkbox. You may need to create a new window by clicking on new and size it to the size that you want. Then you will also need to name it, adjust the sensitivity, which in most circumstances will be between 88 and 93 percent, and then also you'll need to adjust the percentage. Percentage is the amount of screen that has to change for motion to be detected. In this case, you will want to generally set that to a low number between one and 4% with a sensitivity rating between 89 and 94. Thank you for taking your time to look at the ST7501 camera configuration tutorial. If you need any assistance, you can reach us at 1-800-997-8460. Select option 1 for sales and option 2 for technical support. Thank you, and we appreciate the opportunity to earn your business.